Hi everybody and welcome to another Monday Prime Me. This week I am planning from the 12th to the 18th of November and the kit I'm using is Autumn Kisses from the Plump Planner. I ordered her regular two sheet key kit and both add-on pieces so I've got the date covers and the bottom washi and everything else as well. Um, I also thought I would pull in some foiled overlay stickers from Diamond Prince Designs and I'm also using this autumn foiled washi as well so I'm now going to place down all of the kit. So for this week I'm going to place the washi from the kit along the top to cover up the dates and put the date covers from the kit underneath and use the leaf washi at the bottom. The kit comes with three different glitter header options so I just use those I don't scatter them, I just um, use one cover top and then downwards as you will see in a minute. Um, I do scatter my full boxes to kind of separate up the day. And then I decided because um, obviously I've got a happy planner there was some space at the bottom so I used some thin orange washi and once placing all the headers and the full boxes I then move on to my sidebar I just use a full box to cover up the calendar and then these quarter boxes and the weekly checklist for meals normal checklist for to do's and a habit tracker for reading so let's move into the day by day obviously for Monday we have to start with coffee Monday so I use this uh, pumpkin spice latte cup from the Coffee Monsters Co. And then I want to share my weekly spread on Instagram. So I use one of the Autumn Girls from Fox and Cactus. And then I want to work on some blog work. So I use a emoji on a laptop to mark that and I place it on top of a quarter box from the kit I want to start designing some of my stuff for my Christmas videos so I use one of these I think they're appointment labels I think with a foiled bow from Planning by Miss Eve just to mark design then I need to mark that this plan with me went live at 5 so I use a YouTube emoji for that and then lastly I just use a cosy emoji to mark that I want to binge watch Plan With Me videos on YouTube. Moving on to Tuesday I will be meeting my mum so I use a half box and a pumpkin spice munchkin from Once More With Love.
While we're having a look around town, I want to start picking up some stocking fillers for the girls. So I use a quarter box and a shopping MOT and just write stocking fillers. I then use a checklist just so I can write down some bits that I need to pick up while I'm at town and then both my girls have after school clubs on this day so I use a emoji holding a pen to mark homework club for my eldest and a unicorn cat can't remember the shop this is from but I use one of those to mark that my youngest has film club. Moving on to Wednesday if my washing machine decides it's going to work I need to get some laundry done. I then have a Your World of Colour PR package I would like to film for Friday so I use a flag from the kit and a YouTube play button from Coffee Monsters Co because the flag's cream I don't know if it's going to show up that much but I did place a flag first and then over the weekend, uh, one of the other girls from Your World of Colour PR team, she shared about using something called Hootsuite to help with Instagram posts and stuff. So I've started using that. So I use a foiled bow and write a social schedule so I can sort out stuff that I want to be posting for next week. I then use a water box and a nail polish sticker from Coffee Monsters Co to mark that I want to paint my nails. And then lastly I need to do my online shopping order for the week. So I use a shopping MOT and a foiled grocery script from Planning by Miss Eve. Moving on to Thursday, it's payday, so I use this payday flag that came from a sheet from Lucinda Charlotte. I then have buy all the stickers from Your World of Colour. And then I use this three checklist half box from the kit, it has to do written down the side. But I have this build you script that I use just to cover it up. Then I use a quarter box and a YouTube play button again to mark that I need to edit the video I filmed on on Wednesday. I then use a half box and another foiled bow to mark that it is parents evening for my eldest daughter. And then lastly, I use a bin sticker from Once More With Love to mark which bins need to go out. Moving on to Friday, I need to plan next week and film it. So I use, um, I did put a quarter box down but it was a bit pointless because it gets covered up in a minute. But I then use a 
foiled planning time sticker and a YouTube play button from Coffee Monsters Co to mark that. Then it is my focused Friday, so I use a flag and a spray bottle sticker both from the kit. I then use a grocery script sticker again and then once I've done my online shopping I'll write underneath that what time it is being delivered. I then use a half box and a YouTube emoji to mark that my Your World of Colour PR package video will be going up. And then lastly for Friday it is family time so I use a pizza box from Fluffy Marrow Designs. For Saturday I need to edit and do the voiceover for next week's plan with me so I use a half box and a YouTube play button with a musical emoji. <clears throat> I also want to get some more blog work done so I use a quarter box and a girl on a laptop from Stationery Heaven Co and just write blog next to it. In the afternoon I want to do some baking with the girls so I use this emoji eating pumpkin pie and I also want to sit down and write the girls Santa letters with them so I use this emoji from uh, Coffee Monsters Co. Moving on to Sunday again I have laundry to do so I use an emoji sticker I want to do some Facebook promoting for Diamond Prince Designs, so I use a Facebook emoji. Talking about Hootsuite earlier, I need to take pictures for the things that I want to share through that, so I use a foiled bow. And then it's school on Monday, so it is early night which I use a emoji in a bear onesie for that and then I just put a checklist down which I call my school checklist just for all the bits I need to remember and make sure are done ready for Monday morning. And lastly, I just place my weekend banner at the bottom and I will go th through and fill in all the checklists. So this is my spread all finished. I filled in my checkboxes and put all the foiled overlays on. thought it looked nice to put some on the box up there as well. Um, but that is my spread finished for this week. If you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you are new and um, please subscribe i'd love to have you here on my channel and <clears throat> i will see you in my next one